So that's my phone. Let me just make that quiet. So I recently had to do a bit of a reinstall on my armor, and it has caused me a real headache. Um, well, I mean, as far as headaches go, I suppose there's bigger headaches to be fair, but um, I had to do like a whole host of reconfiguring, lost all my settings for my Warthog, um, and it just feels like I'm back to flying like a beginner again. Uh, so ultimately this is just going to be me kind of playing around a bit whilst flying, just trying to get used to controlling it and doing it and all that kind of good stuff. Just such a challenge at the minute. Just back to flying like a beginner and I'm not feeling confident when I'm flying. Um, just you know when you first go on like a multiplayer server and you're flying around and you keep crashing and people are swearing at you? I'm not having that but I just feel like you do when that first happens, you know. You don't want to be killing anybody or anything like that but it just so happens that it just doesn't go your way. So I'm just going to be playing around. You'll probably see me playing around with the settings quite a bit now as you can see I'm just diddling around with my pedals there. Just, just, sorry, just looking down at the floor. So if you saw me looking down at the thing, I was actually looking down at the floor. Um, so let's just run through current configuration controls. Okay. So currently joystick, throttle, rudder and track IR are what I would probably say the four main interfaces here. It's, um, and I've been twiddling around with the settings. So, anyway, let's just uh, get airborne. And we'll just take a look at it. So we've got that ghost hawk there. We're going to get out and fly that in a bit. Um, it's the helicopters I'm mainly having issues with, the A-10 uh, and the uh, stealth chopper there, we're going to get out and fly that in a bit. But I just want to kind of just find some agility in my flying at the minute, because I just don't feel like I've got any agility right now when I'm flying. Um, I've gone from being able to put it down on a you know, on a small coin to now I, I need like a a full kilometres line up in 20 minutes just to get these things down on the ground. Um, so I just want to try and just find my mojo again. I'm feeling good with the controls, I think, just at the minute. You know, sometimes you're not on it and then sometimes you are. Um, but I'm just sometimes... Oh, that was a bit harsh. Oof, Gordon Bennett, that was nearly one landing, one death. That's shocking. Let's go over to the um, industrial estate there and just see if we can um, land it somewhere interesting. Where are we going to go for? Where are we going to go for? Let's have a look. Oh, there we go. We'll land it in that little area there. Nope. Missed it completely. See, what I wanted to go for was exactly where I'm pointing at now. In there. But, nope. Couldn't do it. Just not at peace with my controls. So what we're going to do, we're going to swing around and we're going to do it again. Uh, I have got my um, what's it configured? I've got my trim configured. It's not a trim issue though, it's just a Oh, are we going to do this? Yes, we are. Um, oh. You 
You see, this actually isn't the optimal approach as well, and I know that. That's probably what's causing me a bit of flux. Let's swing it around. Let's just try and tuck this in there. Come on, come on. That's that tail rotor as well. Do you know? Something's just not sitting right. Let's just... Um, I need to imagine that this is like a proper combat thing here and I'm doing an emergency extract or something, I don't know. This is just not good flying. So that's a bit better, isn't it? The approach was far better and we're down. So that felt a bit better, that felt a little bit more organic. Um, I think I could probably do just tweaking my throttle to be a little bit more sensitive. So let's just get it down on the ground. So let's configure controls, control, uh, throttle, customize. I've got a bit of a dead zone there, let's just kill that dead zone altogether. So, generally, if you look at my throttle controller and you can just see me wiggling it up and down, I tend to operate it between this first marker, this middle marker for lift, and the next notch up here, for standard flight. It's very rare that I go full throttle. Um, but I tend to balance just somewhere about there. It's kind of like my balanced control. So I maintain airspeed whilst also maintaining agility of the vehicle as well. So I just want to do this approach again in here. Oh, Jesus. That was nearly game over with that one as well, so... Yeah, I'm just uh, having issues with the agility of the... Oh, shit. Balls. No, managed to rescue that. Don't know how, don't know why, but managed to do it. So I'm just having issues altogether in terms of just how... How all of these are tying in together. Let's, um... Let's pick a different area just for now, and then we'll go on to the uh, Ghost Hawk and see how we do with the Ghost Hawk. Um... I've got no idea what happened to my settings. It's like my armor was there and then it wasn't. But then all my all my control settings just completely disappeared. Um, and it's not as if you know it's a simple thing to do. Well, well here's me complaining, um, you know. But you know when you've got a whole task, you have about bloody 50, 60 different buttons and configurations. So it takes a long time to reconfigure. Um, and so that's what's happened here. I'm just having to reconfigure it and find my mojo, and I'm just. It's taken me some time. Anyway, what we'll do is we'll fly out to the carrier later on in that black, uh, in that black wasp. There's the um, the black hawk. But for now, let's just try and land on top of this garage. Nope, it's just not happening. It's just not happening at all. I'm kind of like a bloody beginner. Right, that's down, that's good. Right, that refilled as well, very nice. Okay. You know what, let's take it over to that island over there and just see what's going on there. Let's see if we can keep this kind of agility or just dial in this agility. I'm comfortable with the pedals. The pedals are really, really nice, so if I just slow it down Need to be about 144 for proper. There we go. So there we go. Full right pedal. Nice and balanced. And then full left. Again. So full right. Full left. Let's 
just see if we can pop it down. You see, that would have been a slam into the building if I hadn't have corrected that. And normally, I wouldn't need to correct that. I don't know what's going on. I just seem to be out of touch. You know, doing a, a spiralling descent is kind of the first thing you kind of master, isn't it, really, when you're going in for a drop? Let's, um, let's go in again. Pick that nose up. Okay. The altitude's too high on.